Hey, this is Shane from Performance EV. Welcome to our first proper video. So, why don't you join us today as we tear down a descend leaf drive unit. What we have here is the drive unit from a 2014 Nissan Leaf. This is a second generation drive unit. In 2013, the engineers at Nissan changed how they actually built these units and effectively redesigned them to make them lighter more efficient, but I'm guessing also easier to manufacture. So they moved all the key components into a single stack with the power delivery module at the top, the inverter in the middle, and the motor at the bottom. The reduction gear is then bolted onto the side of the motor with the drive shafts connecting directly into that reduction gear. All the connections then come out of the key units. So most of the power connections go from the power delivery module whereas all the, a lot of the data connections go into the inverter itself. Uh, the connection, key connections between the units are often internal. So the first step we're going to do is to remove the power delivery module from the inverter. I'm going to try and leave most of the connections intact so we can talk through them later. But what we need to remember here is that not all the connections are external to the units. There are one or two that are actually deep inside. So first thing we're going to do is we're going to remove this 12 volt positive and uh, so we can get at the connections between the power delivery module and the inverter. Okay, so with that tucked out of the way, we can now get at the internal connections. I've already removed the two 10mm bolts that hold this cover plate in place. Now we're going to pull out and see what's inside. So if we shine some light in here, you can see the two bus bars connecting the power delivery module to the inverter. So these carry the um, full 300 and something volt DC current, one positive, one negative. So we're going to undo this and um, then start doing undoing the external connections. Hopefully everything's disconnected. We can just lift this off. One Nissan Leaf power delivery module. So next up, the inverter. 
So you can see up here the two internal connections that went between the PDM and the inverter. There's another couple of connections on the bottom side of this inverter between it and the motor unit. But they really don't want you to get in here. All right, let's get this plate off and see what's inside. And once again, we've got some pretty solid connections going in. So unlike the positive and negative DC that was going from the PDM into the inverter, this is where we get the three phase AC going from the inverter into the motor. So one connection for each of those uh, phases. So we'll get these undone and then move on to the next. All right, that's the internal connections undone. Now we've got, again, only a handful of bolts to do around each of the four sides, and we should be able to get this inverter off the motor. Okay, so I've removed most of the wiring harness mounting points and then the only thing left now is again a coolant tube. I'm going to leave the other one attached for the moment so we just need to undo one right here. Alright, that should be everything disconnected on the, between the inverter and the motor. So let's give this a go. One Nissan Leaf inverter disconnected. So this gives us a really good opportunity just to look at the uh, core of the drive unit which is the um, permanent magnet AC motor and if you look at it I think the first thing that hits you really is just how small it is so really the motor goes from here to here all the other stuff we took off is purely to control it but this is where the power comes from disconnect the reduction drive and any extra pipes that are just going to get in the way and we'll um, put them up on the bench too. First thing I'm going to do is remove the mounting points and uh, get us clear access at the bolts that we need to undo.
there we have them apart. All right, we're just gonna clean up, uh, take a few more things off the motor, then get both of these up on the bench. Nissan Leaf drive unit disassembled. Got the four constituent parts laid out. Power delivery module, inverter, the motor, and on the floor here, the reduction gear. That's it for today. We're gonna to spend some time in future videos looking at each of these units in a lot more detail, and I hope you'll join us for that. Please subscribe, click the notify icon if you wanna to be told when we've got new videos come out. Thanks for joining us.